Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Hello, my dear pupils. Welcome to Sitwa International School Ibadan Real Estate Nigeria. This is e learning platform. Primary 5 Basic Science and Technology, prepared by Mr. Oden de Yusuf Idowu. This is week 4, lesson 2, and the topic is gravity. In this lesson, we are going to learn what, what is gravity and the weight of an object. Let's start with the gravity. The last time, we discussed the solar system, and we said solar system is the sun and the nine planets together with satellites, asteroids, comets, gas and dust that move around it that is move around the sun and we said the sun is the center of the solar system while the planet revolve around the sun in their circular pathway which is called orbit and we said orbit is the part, uh, circular pathway on which plan a planet moves and that one leads us to graph, uh, planets, and we discuss about the planet as a circular natural object that orbits around a star in space. And we also said a star is an object which produces light, heat, and other forms of energy in space. And we also discuss the difference between we also discuss the difference between planet and satellites. Whereby we, we said satellite is, uh, is a smaller natural body that moves around the larger natural body in space. That is, planet is bigger than satellites. And we gave example of a satellite as a moon. So today, inshallah, we are going to discuss about the gravity. As I mentioned that we are going to learn what a gravity is and the weight of an object. What is gravity? Gravity is the force with which the earth attracts object towards its center. Gravity is the force with which the earth attracts object towards its center. The force with which the earth attracts object towards its center is called force of gravity, or we call it gravitational force. In that sense, we said gravity is the force with which the earth attracts object toward its center and we said the force with which the earth attracts uh, object toward its center is called force of gravity or gravitational force example of that is given in the picture between below the, the planet earth is shown to us here and some object in which uh, the earth attracts toward its center due to what gravity an example can also be cited uh, when you hold a, a spoon or an object. The moment you release it from your hand, the gravity will pull it towards the center of the earth. That is, it, it is going to fall down. It cannot stay where it is. Let, you release it, it will not stay there. It will just go down because the force of gravity will pull it towards itself. That is, towards the center. That one will lead us to weight of an object. That is, the weight of an object will tell us how fast an object is going to move towards the heart. Like this, let me cite an example of that: a stone and a, uh, a nylon. If you immediately you release a stone or a nylon, the first of the the first of both that will first reach the heart is what is the stone because the weight it carries is heavier than that of nylon. Weight of an object. Weight of an object is the measurement of the gravitational pull that is forced on that object. The more the amount of matter in an object, that is its mass, its heaviness, the more the weight of the object. We said weight, and, weight of an object is the measurement of the gravitational pull on that object. The more the amount of matter in an object, the more the weight of the object. Therefore, the weight of an object is the product of its mass and acceleration due to gravity. That is, weight is equal to mass times gravity, a, a multiplication of mass and uh, gravity. And we said gravity is the what? Is the force with which the earth attracts the object towards its center. 
the example of that, I mean, the picture of that is given here. That is, weight is called to what? Mass times gravity. Weight is what? Is equal to mass times gravity. We can uh, uh, just look at this simple arithmetic done here to give us more or uh, better explanation on what we just discussed. And in this lesson, we discussed that a gravity is the force with which the earth attracts object toward its center. And uh, the force with which the earth attracts object toward its center is called force of gravity, or we call it gravitational force. We also said weight of an object. Weight of an object is the measurement of the gravitational pull on, this, on the object. And the more the amount of matter in that object, the more the weight of the object. That's why I cited the, the example of a stone and a, a nylon. You know, the, the, the stone has more uh, mass than that of the nylon. And that is why it is heavier than that of nylon. So we said the weight of an object is the product of its mass and acceleration due to gravity. That is the weight we, we tell the uh, uh, the extent to which that is is going to what fall on the what on the earth. With this, we come to the end of today's lesson. Inshallah, we shall meet. Uh, we shall meet. Uh, Next time, during our uh, next lesson, inshallah, be crowd to lie, we might Allah spare our life to witness um, many more days in our lifetime. Amen. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.